Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Prison Break. We're just entering into Sea Ward. Now, I have been doing a few of the quests between the episodes. Um, just to get a bit of extra cash, you can do the quests once, e once each day. So I figured I might as well go in and do them uh, as much as I can, as often as I can, to try and um, rank up as quickly as possible. So I do have $274,000. Now, Sea Ward is a little bit more difficult um, than the other wards. There's a lot more red um, area, as you can see in some of the quests here. Um, are actually in the red area as well, so if there's other people around, they can actually attack you when you're trying to complete these quests. Um, I don't see anybody around at the moment, so I'll sneak in and show you what this one is about. Um, oh, I have started, have I? Okay, I've got... Okay, 10 eggs. Okay, I, w I was halfway through completing this quest. Um, we need to bring him, I think it's 20, 20 pork chops, 20 steaks, uh, five buckets of milk and ten eggs, I think. Now, getting eggs is a little bit tricky, um, just because we do need to go into this red area down here, and um, it, it could leave us open to being attacked. So I, I kind of li only like to go down there when I see that there aren't other people around. Um, but while I have been running around, actually, I have found a few things. Um, I found some diamond boots which um, someone was dropping from the top somewhere. I don't know why they were doing it, but they were dropping it down um, with protection and unbreaking. It's from the, the Hitman kit. I found a diamond chest plate just lying around, and I found some uh, some iron leggings as well with unbreaking and protection protection also from the kit. So if, you're lo if you've lost some stuff, guys, you can let me know, and I'll hand them back. Um, I think they were just being thrown away, though, so I'm going to pick them up and I might as well use them. I might as well make use of them. I don't think anyone else is going to use them. But um, if you have lost them, let me know and I'll, uh, I'll hand them over. But uh, yeah, let's go and look, get those eggs. We're going to go and uh, try and finish this quest. Now, I think we get $40,000 or something for it. So we do get heaps of cash. And as you can see, this mine is pretty cool as well. It's like an ice... Um, well, it's kind of like an ice skating rink, actually. And then we head off into the mine there, and there's uh, there's gold and a few other things in there as well. And there's lots of clay. Um, so we're going to run down. Let me just eat my pork chop. Let me have one last look around. I don't... Oh, there's a few people running around. It makes me a little bit nervous. Um, so let me just... It, it uh, does make me a little bit nervous when uh, there are people running around. I do have some nice armor on, though. Um, I don't have much of a good sword, though. So, yeah, we're just going to do it. Unfortunately, I don't have speed on me. So, let's run in and see if we can grab any eggs. I, ju I just have all of my stuff on me. So, if I get attacked and killed, um, I'm just going to lose it all. Um, one good thing to do, though, if you, if you did want to attack people, um, you could probably hide down here. You could probably sneak... Um, uh, sneak down here like this and wait for someone to jump over the edge. Um, if you if you were a bit uh, a bit nasty, uh, you could definitely do that and probably get a few kills if you wanted to to play that way. Um, I don't really have the intention at the moment of uh, of killing anybody. All I want is to grab these eggs. Um, okay, how many do I have now? I've got seven eggs. I need another three eggs. Um, so hopefully I can grab three eggs. I might just sneak um, at the moment so people can't actually see my name. Um, tag over here. Well, okay, these chickens are just not dropping eggs. Um, I'm not going to sit around here for half an hour waiting for a, um, waiting for these three eggs. I might come back here a little bit later. Um, but for now, we're going to check out the mines. No eggs. No, I've been I've been sitting here for a few minutes and um, yeah, not getting any eggs. So hopefully, we'll be able to finish that uh, that quest off a little bit later. Um, for now, I'm going to head off into the mine. We do need to uh, complete another quest, which is uh, getting an anvil for some guy. So we need uh, we need quite a bit of iron for the anvil. We need uh, three blocks of iron, which is 27 ingots, plus an extra four. So I think we need four, uh, 31 ingots of um, of iron to do that quest. Now I do have a few torches on me. I'm just going to use my explosive pickaxe here, and uh, might as well see what we can grab. Um, yeah, so I'm going to do a bit of ironing here. Uh, ironing. I'm going to do a bit of mining here, <laughs> and I'll be back in a sec. Okay, guys, so I've kind of destroyed half of this place uh, with my explosive pickaxe. Now I'm going to run back and smelt this uh, this iron. Um, I think I'm going in the wrong direction here. Um, yeah, unfortunately, I don't have a lot of room in my inventory, so I can't do a lot of mining just because I don't have a shop at the moment. So I've got all of this coal I'm holding on to, and I've got a few other bits and pieces that I'd really like to, uh, to put into uh, to storage uh, while I go out mining, but I just don't, um, don't have the shop yet. I do need to rank up to Sea Ward uh, so that I can actually 
Uh, where are we going? We're heading over this way. Yeah, I do need to rank up to C3 so that I can actually go and buy a cell. Now the cells I think in this uh, in this ward are a little bit more expensive. I'm just going to run down here and see if I can find any eggs. Um, I only need three eggs to complete this uh, complete this challenge. But oh, there's one over there. No one hiding in here. No, there's no one hiding. I think the eggs. Okay, nine. Here we go. Ten. And yeah, we've got a few eggs here. Eleven and twelve eggs. Okay, beautiful. So we've got um, a couple of spare eggs there that we can use for the the quest the next time around. So let's quickly run and uh, finish that quest, and that should get us. I think it's forty thousand dollars, which is really really cool. Then we'll go and do the anvil quest. I think that's another twenty thousand dollars. So we should be just about ready to rank up. There we go. Forty-five thousand dollars has been added to our account. So we're at uh, three hundred nineteen thousand dollars at the moment. Now there is a quest down here, and I'll just show you. Um, actually, let's do the Anvil quest first, and then I'll show you the, the quest that um, I haven't been able to complete, uh, because it is a little bit strange. Um, this guy here, okay, w Wiley, Wiley, is that his name? Okay, we need to bring him one Anvil. Dude, I got a wicked headache. Can you get me an Anvil? Um, I sure can. So let's confirm this quest. You do not have enough space in your inventory. Okay, I haven't had that one before. Now, I'll sort out my inventory. Okay, what I might do actually is just head back to the shop and sell this stuff. Actually, I might give away some of my stuff. Some of the, uh, some of my armor I might give away to uh, see if I can find a newbie. So let's go back to spawn. Um, and we'll head through here and I'll go to the shop as well. Um, I'll find some guy who doesn't have any armor on him, and I'll give him some pants and a shirt as well. Maybe one, of, maybe these guys want something. Let's have a look. He's he's got a diamond, a diamond sword. So I think he um, maybe he's 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 sorted. He's he's got tattoos all over him as well. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Um, okay, let's find someone. Let's go to E Ward. I'm gonna pop into E Ward. Um, give someone some pants and a chest plate. And these guys are probably struggling quite a bit, uh, possibly. Find someone. This guy doesn't have a, uh, a chest plate. Here we go. Um, where's he gone? He's just disappeared. Oh, he's up there. Hey, buddy, come down, buddy. <laughs> let's uh, let's see if he wants this uh, this chest plate here. Um, see if we can get his get his attention. Uh, he's hello, buddy. Um, here we go. Uh... <laughs> oh, he's got a chest plate. Okay, never mind. We'll find some other new. Some uh, some dude to give uh, to give this chest, chest plate to. Otherwise, I might just leave it um, handy le um, out in the corridor. I think there is a bin somewhere around here as well, isn't there? There is a bin somewhere around. This guy doesn't have any pants. Let's see if he wants some. Let's see if he, I can give him some pants. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't. Let's, I'm just gonna throw it at him. There we go. <laughs> They're gonna run away. There we go. And this guy doesn't have a shirt. Here you go, buddy. Oops. Hey, come back, buddy. Oh, he's running away too fast. Um, yeah, how am I going to get rid of this chest plate? I might just uh, just put it here in the entrance, and hopefully someone who needs it will uh, will find it. And um, there's not many people around at the moment. I am on usually at, uh, at different times. But um, there we go. There's a chest plate if somebody wants it. Otherwise, it will disappear in a few seconds. Now, I might as well just run into the shop here. I think they all give the same prices. Um, I could actually sell off some of my coal, but I might just hang on to it for the moment because I do want to... Um, okay, I don't want to sell redstone one at a time. Now, I'll go to the sea shop. That's uh, probably a bit better. Um, yeah, I don't want to um, run out of coal because if I am going to be doing some smelting and taking some stuff to the, to the sea ward, I definitely want to have as much coal as I can uh, possibly get, um, just because it's uh, yeah, it's probably the well. I mean, if I've got it, I don't don't need to buy it anymore. So um, yeah, I'm just going to hang on to that. But we're going to head into the C shop now. I think we can sell redstone at uh, one stack a time, one stack per click. So hopefully we can do that. Uh, redstone. Here we go. Okay, I've got. I think I've only got a couple of stacks of that, and I've got three stacks of lapis lazuli as well. There we go. Now I need to smelt my iron ore and the gold, so we can sell that. And I should be able to to take up the quest. I've got one one raw beef here. Let me just sell this raw beef. Uh, where are we? Raw beef. There we go. I just need the inventory space. Is there anything else I can chuck? I kind of want to hang on to everything else. Um, 
yeah, so we'll just hang on to everything else for now and hopefully we can rank up and we will be able to get a sell uh, for ourselves. Now, we're going past this guy again, so I might as well show you what he's all about. Now, he's standing on some weird spot there, but uh, Johnny Apple... Johnny... <laughs> Johnny Apple Poop. All right, that's his name. Johnny Apple Poop. He says, um, okay, I'm losing... Okay, I can't really read that, but uh, bring me five golden apples. He says, um... Something about to make poopy, and I need five gold apples. Help. Um, yeah, I don't know what this guy's on about. Um, $30,000 for five golden apples. I guess we can chop down a few trees and see if, see if some of the apples drop. Um, I haven't had a tree... I haven't had an apple drop for me yet uh, during this game. Um, so... Okay, so I have been um, chopping down these trees, as you can see, but there's no apples falling at all, so I'm just not going to worry about this quest. I'm not sure how to get those apples. Uh, maybe they do drop eventually, I'm not sure. Maybe they're just really rare, um, but it's not really worthwhile kind of sitting around waiting for them. So what I'm going to do is um, head off to um, to Wiley, or Willy, or whatever his name is, and uh, we'll get him this anvil, and that should get us another $20,000, and that is uh, almost enough to rank up, actually, So which is pretty cool. Um, and then then once we've done that, I'm going to run around and do all of the other quests as well. So let's just run in here. We're going to do some smelting. Um, let's get some coal going. I'm going to oops, going to smelt. Uh, let's, let's just smelt all of this iron ore here, and I'm going to run into the well. Open up this one down here and smelt all of the gold, and that shouldn't take me too long. And uh, yeah, we'll be back once that has all been done. Okay, guys, we've just um, found a guy who is uh, going to be selling us. Uh, apples. Um, let's say hi to him. Um, yeah, he he's giving us apples. Um, hang on. Um, what is the command for actually uh, giving someone money? I'm not even <laughs> I'm not even sure how to do that. I've never done that before. Um, so let's say I will buy I will buy seven. Um, I'll buy seven apples off this guy for seven thousand dollars. I can sell five of them. Um, I can sell five of them for thirty thousand dollars. So let me just work out how to actually buy this stuff. Okay, let's see. Give uh, Kieran two thousand six. I hope he's not a scammer. Is this guy a scammer? Um, let's see. Let's see. Ah, uh, give. Oh. How's this work? Do slash give Kieran 2006. Kieran 2006. Don't have access to that. Um, yeah, not sure how to do this. Um, do you have a shop? Let's just see if this guy has got a uh, shop and uh, maybe we can buy the apples from him uh, that way. Otherwise, um, yeah, I'm not sure how to do it otherwise. So, unfortunately, I really want these apples though. Um, yeah, I really want these uh, these apples. Hopefully, he's not a scammer and, um, and he will actually be legit and I can buy them from him. Um, otherwise, we're just going to have to set up a shop and... Um, yeah, do it that way. Hopefully we can buy a few apples. So, anyway, let's see if Kieran responds. Okay, he does have a shop. Okay. Okay, I'll follow you to your shop. Okay, we're going to follow... Uh, Kieran to his shop, and uh, hopefully uh, he'll be able to set up the uh, the apples, and uh, we'll be able to buy them. So I'll be back in a sec. I think he's got speed as well. I am pretty slow. Okay, so we're just at uh, Kieran 2006 uh, shop. Um, so cool. He's uh, he's selling some stuff. I'm just gonna have a check around here. He's gonna probably uh, set up the uh, the. Um, the sign there so I can buy those apples which would be really really cool um, let's see what else he's got though buy a dropper buy a sapling sell one emerald sell one string sell one diamond sell 64 coal sell 64 coal uh, let's see what he's uh, let's see five sell one coal for 200 is that uh, did he get that right sell one coal for 200 are you 
Let me see if he's actually selling. Selling coal for 200. All right, buy one apple for a thousand. Okay, yeah, here we go. Cool, beautiful. Okay, beautiful. Thanks, Kieran. <laughs> um, I wouldn't mind selling him some coal. I think it's a bit of a. Um, uh, I feel like I'm. <laughs> he's happy about it. He's happy about it. Okay, no problem. He's he's actually buying coal for two hundred bucks, which is um, a really 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 bad deal for him. But I'm um, considering I just bought the apples off him. Um, yeah, I, I, I don't feel like I'm um, scamming him with the uh, with the coal. So what I'm going to do is um, actually I'm just going to head back to spawn. Um, we can do that quest um, with the apples and get an extra 30k there. We can do the anvil quest as well. Um, if I can actually uh, get through this door, look at this guy here with his uh, he's got a face on the back of his head. Um, yeah, some interesting characters here, some interesting uh, skins as well. So it's pretty cool. So the Rush Row 721 has just ranked up. Um, let's congratulate them and uh, try to uh, try to be nice to the people around us. Uh, yeah, so what have we got? What, what are we doing here? Okay, seven apples. Um, so let's actually, I need to, yeah, we need to go back to the crafting table. Okay, so I'm back in the little crafting room here. Now we're going to do uh, make all the things we need for all of the quests, um, for all of the wards. So we're going to make the iron pickaxe, we are going to make the, uh, the axe here, um, we're going to make the it's five golden apples, wasn't it? Something like that. Well, we've got three golden apples. Um, we need another two. We are going to need uh, five milk buckets as well, but we've we've just done that quest actually, so I won't be able to do that quest today. Um, we also need. Uh, let's see. Am I going to have room in my inventory? Okay, so we've got the the iron pickaxe quest, uh, the iron axe quest. This is uh, for E ward, isn't it? And then we've got all all the leather we need um, for that. So that's all E ward, and then D ward we have um, the fish, but um, unfortunately we don't. I'm um, not able to get the fish, so I'm not going to bother with that. Um, and we have the rail track, so we need 16. Oops, need uh, 32 rail tracks um, for the D ward quest. Uh, the other D ward quest is the. Um, there we go. It's the leaves there, isn't it? Um, so that's the E ward quest, the D ward quests. Now um, the other quest we have here is the anvil quest. Um, so I can start turning these into iron blocks here. We need three iron blocks. Um, we can make another one there, and we've got some more gold there uh, for the apples. Now I've got. Yeah, I'm gonna have to wait for this to smelt. Okay, so everything has just finished smelting. Let's um, finish off making these apples. I think I just have enough uh, for five apples. There we go. So that should be five apples, and I've got two apples spare, which is really, really cool. Now I need to make a couple of um, uh, iron blocks here. Another two iron blocks. There we go. Now we're going to make this anvil just like this. And there we go. I think I think that is everything we need uh, to, compl to complete all of the quests, except for the uh, the fishing quest. Um, so yeah, let's go and do it, and we'll see how much money we can get, and uh, hopefully we will be able to rank up. So let's go talk to Willie, and we're going to confirm this quest. There we go, twenty thousand dollars, beautiful, twenty thousand bucks. Now um, the next quest, I think we need to head off to D Ward. So we're going to go back to spawn, and we're just going to run into uh, D Ward here. And if I can remember where the quests are, um, yes, it's all coming back to me now. It's amazing how quickly you forget. But I'm going to run off to the uh, the conductor over here. And I spent so long mining on that wall, so long you would not believe it, uh, trying to get those tickets. But anyway, we're going to talk to the conductor, we're going to accept this quest, yes, there we go. Okay, there's one more quest we need to do in this ward. Okay, so we're just going to get some, uh, some leaves here, we need 60 leaves, and uh, we should be able to get them really, really quickly. Um, how many? 60... 64. There we go. We got 64 leaves. Beautiful. So let's go talk to Mia Stoner. Uh, finish this quest. I think we get uh, 4,000 if I remember cor correctly. Yes, we got $4,000. Um, so we're getting 
um, smaller and smaller amounts, but we're going to head off to E-Ward. We might as well do them all. Uh, I think we get an extra three... No, uh, let's see, how much is it? Three and a half thousand dollars for doing these quests. So I'm just going to run in here and we'll do the... Uh, the uh, this quest here, the David Leatherman quest. Um, I don't... Let's just get rid of those leaves there. Okay, so we're going to... Oops. Get the boots. Pants. Uh chest piece and the the boots there as well and I don't have any room um, let me just check out those those iron boots there okay so talk to David Leatherman confirm am I missing something what am I missing oh no the hat oh no oh drats let me uh, let me get some more leather. That girl just uh, just picked up uh, my stuff there, which is cool. Doesn't really bother me. Um, so, where are these cows going? I really don't like uh, trying to to find these cows in um, in E Ward because they're so far apart. It's uh, it's much much better in D Ward. I think uh, D Ward is the is the best spot for for getting leather. Um, here's a cow over here. So let's just grab a few cows. There we go. I think that's all I need, actually. Just those five. Okay, so I'm just going to grab the uh, the headpiece here. Uh, there we go. So that should be everything. We should get an extra one and a half thousand dollars. There we go. Okay, we're almost up to almost up to three hundred fifty thousand um, dollars. So we've got uh, two more quests to do here for another two thousand bucks. I'm going to talk to um, to what's his what's his name over here, and give him the the uh, iron axe. And lastly, we're going to run off uh, to see Blacklung and give him the iron pickaxe. Okay, let's do this quest quickly. Bang! There we go. We've hit the three hundred fifty thousand dollar mark, and I see a lot of a uh, lot of iron over here. Maybe I should uh, should get grab some of this iron while I'm here. There we go. Might as well grab a few bits of iron um, while I'm here. It's always always handy to have. So let me just grab that one, and I might as well go down and, and uh, see if I can pick up ten or ten or twenty pieces of iron here, which would be absolutely fantastic. So there we go. Okay, I didn't get uh, much, um, many iron ingots there. I think I got uh, maybe two or three because some other guy came in and uh, took them all before I got there. Um, so we are $10,000 short from ranking up. Um, but I just remembered I still do have my golden apples on me. So let's do this quest. Um, I wasn't expecting to be able to do this quest. Let's go talk to Johnny Apple Poop. <laughs> That's his name. Uh, I think he wants five golden apples. It's a bit hard to read on, uh, on this screen. But here we go. There we go, $30,000. All right, we got $380,000. Ah, so we finally made it. We can rank up to uh, to C3, which is what I really need to do. Um, so it gives me a, a haste boost with mining. And also we can go and find a shop and, um, yeah, hopefully sell some stuff. And I can put all my crap away. I can put all my junk away um, so that I have uh, space in my inventory to do, to do some mining and uh, hopefully get heaps of gold and heaps of other things as well and uh, we can rank up even further and hopefully get to B Ward really quickly really really quickly so I'm gonna rank up here guys uh, here we go this guy's always a little bit hard to talk to let me see if I can yes we've ranked up beautiful beautiful thank you so much guys for watching that's all we have time for in this episode I'll see you all again soon bye for now bye what am I doing? I'm going into the wrong ward. <laughs> I'm always going into the wrong ward. I'm C ward now. C ward. See you guys. Ah! Oh, I just dropped my pick. Oh my goodness. <laughs> See ya.